Hi everyone, I'm John Lombana. I just wanted to quickly teach you a little lesson of a 30 second note hand pattern. Okay, so it's a very simple idea. We're gonna take a paradiddle diddle, which is normally played leading with the right hand, right, left, right, right, left, left. But this time we're gonna play the same pattern leading with the left hand. We're gonna go left, right, left, left, right, right, like this. Okay, so the next step is gonna be that I'll start the pattern with the right hand instead of with the left. So I'm basically just displacing the pattern by one stroke. So here's what I'm now doing. I'm going right, left, left, right, right, left. It sounds like this. So the next step is that I'm going to start orchestrating each pattern, right? So every pattern has six strokes. The first one I'm going to play in this way. The second group of six notes I'll play in this way. The third will go like this. The fourth one I'll orchestrate in the following way. And we're going to finish the fill with a pattern that only consists of five notes and the sticking is going to be right, left, left, right, left. It sounds like this. Now putting each group together. Now this pattern is generally played as a 16th note triplet pattern, but what I'm actually gonna do in this case is I'll play it as a 32nd note pattern. When you practice this, try to keep eighth notes on the hi-hat while you play the, the whole fill. In this way, when you play the left hand stroke on the hi-hat, you're gonna get like a splash sound. So as soon as you play that open hi-hat, your foot is going to close it and it's gonna make the fill sound more special. Okay, finally, I'm just going to show you how the fill would sound like with a groove. So I'm going to be playing three bars of a groove, then a fill, then three bars of a groove, and so forth. Now, once you've got this pattern down, what you can do is that you can start the fill in a different bit of the bar. So let's start by starting it on the two. Instead of starting on the one, I'm going to go one, two. So on that two, I'm gonna be playing the entire fill. Of course, you may have to finish the fill in a different way, so you can just find any way to resolve at the end. Okay, another idea is to basically start the fill on the A ah of two. What do I mean by that? One E and A, two E and A. Ah. 
Okay, so once again, you get a pretty interesting idea. This is what it sounds like. Okay, everyone, I hope you enjoyed that lesson. Thank you so much for all the support. All the best.